Okay, what is up, guys? It is Rockcraft94, or my YouTube name, which is Multi Hat Tutorials. And today I'm going to be showing you how to use Solaris. And the example website I've got here is SpartanPress.co.uk. And as you can see, it's up. And just to confirm that, down for everyone or just me, this is a really useful tool. I'll put it in the description. Go check it out. Very useful to know if a website's still up or if it's just you. Right. So what we're going to start by is downloading Solaris. The link will be in the description and you'll get a little app .exe application line here you're going to go new right click new text document and then you can rename that whatever you want and then you're going to open up file save as and then put it as all files save as type all files then rename it slow loris or whatever you want but make sure you put this bit dot or period i think it's called in america B A T, bat, which stands for batch, <coughs> and it has to be in the same folder, else things will go a bit funny. Right, and then what you can do is right-click, edit on the bat file that you just created, and you're going to put in slow loris dot exe. Then you're going to put the name of your web server, which for me is www.spartanpress.co.uk. And then you're going to put it so it goes through port 80, and I think it's a thousand times, another thousand times, just put the two of thousands there. I'm not quite sure what they do. But now I'm just going to explain a quick bit about what it's going to do. It's going to it's going to um, take up all the sockets because to make a web server you need to put forward sockets and things, whatever it's called, I don't know. But s there's a socket per person that logs onto the server. And what Slowloris does, it takes up each one of those sockets slowly. So say if you're on a really high high traffic website, it's going to take you a while to take up those sockets. But it, it keeps the connections open by sending a series of HTTP GET requests. And it's very low bandwidth because it's just sending those get requests and it's like um, searching for in YouTube diet and you get back 10,000 results and it continuously searches that and that's using the web server the web server is doing all the work there and not you which makes it so low bandwidth it was coded by an awesome guy called Arsenic and it's um, it's effective on <coughs> Apache 2.0 times and 1.0 times and the go-ahead web servers and also it's unconfirmed but it might be useful on websense which are blocked pages which my school actually uses so without further ado let's get this started and just to make sure that the website is still open let's just refresh that and we will refresh this tab as well refresh and as you can see it's still up it's still up there still up Right, so let's just minimize this. Blah, 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 there. And now what you're going to do is run the bat file. Don't run the application, run the bat file. And then it's going to start attacking. And as you can see, it says 996 out of 1,000 sockets used. So those 1,000 numbers that we put in earlier must have been the amount of sockets. And just let it get started. <coughs> Give it like 10 seconds and then it'll start saying error. There you go. That doesn't matter. In fact, the website is probably down. It is that fast, literally. You don't even have to have a fast upload speed. But I'm just going to warn you, you, I would advise you to use a VPN. That's what I'm using at the moment. If you don't want a VPN, is, then PM me and I will tell you. And as you can see, it's down already. That is that quick. But it only works. It won't work on anything like a, a big server like eBay or Google or YouTube because they're just too big, they're too strong and they probably don't even run off Apache, they probably run off some kind of Google powered thing <laughs> as you can see it's down it's that simple and then as it uses up the sockets, when it gets to zero it'll just go into the negative, so we'll just show you that <coughs> hang on, what's happened here? let's put you back um, scroll, let's scroll and as you can see it says 976 and that number when it gets to zero it'll just it'll just keep doing this and then it'll go into negative numbers which and 
as soon as you stop, as soon as you stop um, slow lorising it, <laughs> the website will come back up. It's just like that. And slow loris has been used in a lot of attacks recently. Um, you might have heard about the um, Pirate Bay that's been attacked, and I'm pretty sure that would have been slow loris. As you can see, it's just you. Slow lo Spartan Press is up. So if we refresh the Spartan Press page, as you can see, it is up. There you go. And that is it, guys. That is how simple it is. Download link will be in the description for Slow Loris. If you have any trouble at all, just PM me, and I'll be right back to you. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Why don't you say something like, um, ask me a question, I'll answer it. Don't you worry, I will answer it. So, see you guys around. Rockcraft out.